Hey guys, mm -hmm. I'm eating. Um, I got it, and I got a different. I got the other poker game. He said, if there's anything wrong, just bring them back, and we'll trade. He said you got a lot. You bought a game, bunch of games in a lot, and some of them were scratched. So he had no problem taking it back. And he told me why I did wrong on the 362. He told me how to properly sync it. So <coughs> when I'm done with this, I will show you that Red Sox thing I got from my friend. And I talked to the hairdresser yesterday. She said she would do my hair. 20 bucks. I can handle that. It's five dollars off what I usually pay. I'm gonna get it done as a hair wrap or something. Mm. All right. I'll be right back, guys. I'm just going to finish this. Then we'll check these games out. I'll be back. Hey, you guys. Are we going to play Tetris? Oh crap, am I playing? Support you life as we know it. And in the dark, our sun has grown old. Now we learn that it will go nova far sooner than expected. As it runs out of hydrogen, a dark will briefly become the brightest object in our galaxy. We must find a new home. Petrions have been detected on other planets in our galaxy. Your mission is to open the Tetrions on the other side so that we can evacuate safely before our world is destroyed. I'm just waiting for this to stop doing this and actually go to the game. The future of Mio Kai depends on you, Brave Tetranon.
loading, loading, loading. that is not in there. I'm there. Can I have a little patient? This is messed up. 
This PlayStation is messed up. Give me that, I'm messed up. I'm going to take it in the kitchen. I guess I want to show you that. Uh, excuse me! Oh, for goodness sake. I know I have an Today, and I am too tired to deal with that system. I know it's me. I know it's the system and not the game. Um, so we'll call this video gaming fail. <laughs> My cheeks are flushed. Allergies. Allergies. I'm exhausted, so I'm not gonna fight with that. After I hopefully had a good night's sleep tonight, excuse me, I will try it again tomorrow. If I get it to work, I'll show you. I just have to figure out. going on. And I have a meeting Tuesday night at the Historical Society. So I have to remember to be there at 6 o'clock Tuesday night. department heads have to be there. Oops. Um, but we should have two things to unbox tomorrow. We should have an assembly video. 
So yeah, I am not going to put this room back together because I'm going to move this stuff back where it was when I go in my room tonight because I want the room to assemble that. Um, so yeah, this was gaming fail, but that's okay. Oh, I know it's me at this point. At least I learned how to play with the 360. At least I know what I did wrong over there. I have to sync it. Because I changed the batteries, therefore I have to sync it. Because the battery charger wasn't working. Which I told him was fine, because I found one. And I like the external charger better anyway. Ugh. I am going to go curl up with my PJs on, curl up, watch a Judy Bloom documentary. And make my supper I left the camera. Um, thank you for being here. Thank you for being patient with this lousy gamer. <laughs> um, I guess my gaming videos are all what not to do. <laughs> I'm not to game. <laughs> um, at any rate, I will see you tomorrow. Because oh, I am exhausted. Oh, and tomorrow is Monday, so we will have a kid missing video. And it will be the, the, the Hattie E. Jack. An African American little girl. Very little girl. Young child. Who went missing, I believe, in 1961. I'm not looking at it, so I'm not sure. That's tomorrow's case. So please check that out. Um, please check me out on both channels. Please subscribe. We're halfway to our goal on both channels. Halfway to 100 here, halfway, more than halfway to 500 over there. On kid missing. So, I think legally next time, since I'm going to be upstairs filing, probably by myself. I'm going to bring my headphones. My MP3 player. Unless I'm working with Carol. Then obviously I'm going to do that. Um, Please like, please comment, 
Sorry today got a little messed up. I mean, she said it was delivered, and I think it's too heavy to be delivered to the post office. So, I've got to figure out where it went. I'm going to have to go to the US. Dot com. I have to write down the number and go to ups.com and look it up that way. I'll keep you updated. See you guys. Bye bye. Mwah.